hello guys you are welcome to this video i'll be showing you how to easily bind your royal q trading bot with your binance account okay so pay close attention and move with me as i do you can actually pause this video and follow along with yours all right don't forget to like this video share with your friends and comment on the comment section ask any question or any suggestion or any request you have okay and also subscribe to this channel to always get this kind of videos and general crypto trading lessons okay so let's continue so now all you have to do is if you look at the top menu bar of this trading bot you are going to see api binding that is the very first option at the left corner so when you click on api binding you are going to see binance and you're going to see hubi so this trading bot can actually trade into exchange it can trade on binance and it can trade on hubi okay so but we are going to be binding this trading bot currently with binance so you click on binance then you are going to be needing two things you are going to be needing api key and you are going to be needing security key okay you are going to be needing secret key okay and api key so for us to get that we'll move over to binance okay so once we get to binance in this binance home page if you look after liquid swap you are going to see more so you click on more immediately you click on more you scroll down you are going to see api management so you click on api management first you need to create an api so for you to create api so you just name the api so maybe i'll just name it after the bot so okay don nelson royal q so i'll create it normal binance you need to verify this to ensure you are the owner of this account so i'll click on get code get code so i'll have to wait for the text message code all right the email code is here actually so we are waiting for the text message good the text message is here so i'll paste it on the phone verification then i get the email code I move over to Binance and I paste it. I still need one more code. So I'll just click submit. You might not have this Google Authenticator code request if you are not, uh, if you've not activated Google Authenticator on your account. So now this is the API key. You can see it under here. So I'll click on copy. And I go over to Royal Q and I paste it on API key. Then I need to get secret key. So for me to get that secret key, I need to click on this arrow under this API key. So once I click on this arrow, I can see the secret key. So I copy this secret key and I go over to Royal Q and I paste the secret key. Then Royal Q also needs you to verify you are the owner of this account. So it's going to send you a verification code in your email. So I'll click on send. So you need to click on send to be able to get that code. It's actually taking time. So I'll just end this app and start it afresh. Okay, so that to be fast. I think the app is lagging. So I'll click on API binding again. So in case if yours starts delaying like this, this is what you do. So remember we've it just the same thing we did before. So I will paste the API key and I will go back. The secret key. Then I paste it and I click on send code. Good. The code has been sent. So I have to wait for the code in my email. good the code just arrived so i have to copy this code and i go back to royal q and i paste it so now before you click on bind go back to binance when you go back to binance ensure you activate this ensure you click on this enable spot and margin trading if you don't that api is not going to bind also that is the additional option you are to click here. You are not to a click withdrawal. You are not to enable withdrawals because you are not allowing the bot to withdraw and that is just all you need. So for us to do that, I'll just click on edit. 
once i click on edit i can be able to activate this okay so once i activate it i'll click on save then i still need a verification code to ensure i'm the owner of this account so i have to go back to my google authenticator to get my code i go back to binance okay and i submit this so this has automatically been enabled so i have to go over to royal queue and i bind you can see automatically binance changes color to this orange showing that i have automatically bind this then let's go back to binance so that you pay close attention again pay close attention to these api restrictions okay you can see the first one is enable reading so i allow the api to i allow the this api to read which means with these the trading bot can always read the transaction histories then i enable trading i enable sports and margin trading and that is all you need so ensure you did not enable any other thing here okay so if there's any request to for you to enable any other thing here it will be notified through the bot but no matter the request never you enable withdrawal because the bot do not supposed to withdraw money from your binance account and that is what makes this so safe and controllable by you so congratulations once again we finally binded our binance account with our royal q trading bots